So this all came about where uh, Rustapak PTY Limited, which is a South African-based company, had been associated previously with uh, Watson Coatings through the HRCSA technology and product to supply to Eskom Transmissions. And what Rustapak were looking for was a, an outlet, and they saw ABE as the partner of choice. Mm -hmm. uh, because of our footprint in South Africa and because of our footprint into Africa, that we could provide this product and take this technology to a new level, to new customers, to new opportunities. The only limitations that we have for this product is we do not advocate that the product is used in submerged uh, situations. In other words, you could not use it on a buoy, you could not use it in a, um, a bunded area where it would be totally and completely submerged in water. Other than that, the uniqueness of the product, the ease of application of applying this product is just so different to the passive coatings that everybody in this industry is accustomed to. It is our intention and we have already started this process where we um, would approach uh, specialist applicators and get them to come on board. They would need to be accredited, they would need to be trained so that we are sure if we are in our, or, or have to um, offer a warranty that through the trained applicator, uh, through the service providers, us supplying the actual product, that the end user or the client or the asset owner would get peace of mind that the product would uh, provide the necessary longevity that this coating is designed to do. So there is a, a very rigid, strict uh, process that we would go through on the training so that everybody becomes accredited and therefore we know we have peace of mind as the supplier that the applicator is doing the right job and of course your, your end user gets what he's paying for. Because of the limitations of the type of resins that can be used with the calcium sulfonate, currently the alkyd resins, typically alkyds do not weather as good as, say, polyurethanes do. So what we're focusing on is either other resin systems that can be used in the system or modifiers that can be used to increase that outdoor exposure. What it is, is an active seal coating, which is much different than typical coatings, uh, which we consider passive. Uh, most passive coatings just separate uh, moisture and oxygen from the surface, rather than reacting with the surface in, in the environment. Uh, so the Rustapak um, products um, react with the, the environment and react with the surface, giving you much better corrosion protection than passive barrier coatings.